Mary Middlebrook and I'm here volunteering with Adopt a Closed Line in beautiful Antigua and we're at the Windward Tide Pools near Falmouth uh, Harbor and today we're going to look at some sea algae. and if you come out to the beach you're going to see a lot of different species. This is just one species but if you look across here um, in the tide pool you can see all this green color it's not all the same species I'm holding there's lots of different probably dozens of species of sea algae um, out here I've seen this type as well let me pull a piece of this off this very interesting type here so let's talk a little bit about it first I'm gonna ask you a question is this a plant or an animal all right, you got your answer? Okay, the only correct answer to that question is neither. That is a trick question. Because a seaweed is not a true plant. It photosynthesizes like a plant, it gets its energy from the sun, but it's not a plant. A true plant has to have a root system, a stem system for transporting the materials and nutrients and water, and leaves for photosynthesis. A seaweed doesn't have to do that. You don't see roots on these seaweeds. These guys can photosynthesize along their entire bodies. Some of them, as you can see, are attached to these rocks. I'll pull this piece up. This one is actually attached to some sponge. So they have means to attach, but it's not roots, okay? So these guys are actually not in the kingdom plantae with true plants, not in kingdom animalia with true animals. These are in kingdom protista which is one of the five major kingdoms in the, in the world. And Kingdom Protista is what we call a trash can kingdom. If something's not quite a plant and it's not quite an animal, it gets thrown into Kingdom Protista. And these guys aren't quite plants, so that's why they're there. And they're just so much different from plants, like I said, due to their structures, that makes them completely different. And seaweeds can be, or and seaweeds and algae, same thing. Algae can be microscopic, just a single cell. Or you can have kelp that gets 30, 50, 100 feet long. Neither of them are true plants. They're all seaweeds within Kingdom Protista.